Colorado Avalanche left wing Artery Lahonen, 62, celebrates the team's 4-0 win against the Edmonton Oilers with goaltender Pavel Frankus, 39, following Game 2 of the NHL Hockey Stanley Cup Playoffs Western Conference Finals Thursday June 2, 2022, in Denver. AP Photo Slash Jack Dempsey Denver Nazim Kadri had three assists in a 2-0-4 span in the second period, backup Pavel Frankus stopped 24 shots for his second career playoff shutout and the Colorado Avalanche beat the Edmonton Oilers 4-0 on Thursday night to take a 2-0 lead in the Western Conference FINA. The Avalanche broke through in the second after a scoreless opening period that featured something rarely seen so far in this series, defense. Artery Lahonen and Josh Manson scored 15 seconds apart to get things going in the second, with Miko Rondon and adding another on Kadri's third assist. Nathan McKinnon scored late in the third. Game 3 is Saturday in Edmonton. The Avalanche are 5-0 on the road so far in these playoffs, and 15-4 in a best-of-seven series when taking a 2-0 lead. This game was a departure from a high-scoring Game 1 in which there were 14 goals and 84 shots. Frank Hughes grew stronger with every save he made as he stepped in for Darcy Kuemper, who left Game 1 with an upper-body injury. Frank Hughes was serenaded with chance of Frankie. Frankie. From the crowd. Colorado held Edmonton's big three of Connor McDavid, Leon Dreisaitl and Evander Kane to seven shots. Dreisaitl saw his streak of nine straight games with at least one assist come to an end. Mike Smith allowed four goals on 40 shots. This after the 40-year-old Smith was pulled in Game 1 after surrendering six goals. To slow down the speedy McKinnon, Edmonton shadowed him virtually at all times. The relentless pressure included a trip by Duncan Keith after the whistle. It didn't draw a penalty but drew plenty of boost from the crowd. McKinnon also got smacked in the face on a play. The heavy focus on McKinnon opened the door for others like Kadri, who was originally credited with the first goal at 3.58 of the second before it was ruled that Mahonen tipped the puck. Kadri tied the franchise record for assists in a period. It was a mark set by Quebec's Risto Siltonen in 1987 and matched in 1996 by Avalanche Hall of Fame forward turn GM Joe Sackick. Colorado and Edmonton turned in about as entertaining first period as possible for no goals scored. It included Edmonton weathering Colorado's 5-on-3 advantage, 